Hey, welcome back. We're working here. All right, we got a new video for Roulette. Uh, it's Alex and David. It's Old Faithful, buddy. It's Old Faithful. Yep. I'm all bricked up for you. Let's see it. What do you got? What's the name of the system? Oh, or my who's God. It from? It's the name of the system is Brian, apparently. Oh, no, that's the name of the person. Sorry, Brian. Okay, name of the system. Name of the system is two pockets of four on the wheel. Okay. So this is one of those where you just a big brain guy figured out where the pockets are on the wheel, and that's where we're going to bet. Okay. The buy-in amount is exactly... Five hundred and twenty-five dollars. Where? Where do you think he came up with that, dude? Did he Not pull sure. that out of his ass? A little bit. He really did. I mean, that's a bit of a. All right, five hundred twenty-five dollars. I'm sure he worked it out some way with the with the math. Okay. Uh, we're not big on math here, you know what I mean? We're more about the colors and units, you okay. understand? I and mean, that's how we get dealers, you know, the math, not so much. Okay. Some of you guys have too big a brain, too big a brain, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I might as well go ahead and say it. How many of you are you considered roulette nerds? Roulette nerds in the comments. Let, let us know if you're roulette nerds. There's a lot of roulette nerds out there, we understand. Yeah, question of the video, are you a roulette nerd or roulette simp? I'm a total simp, dude. <laughs> okay. I'm a total simp. Uh, okay, ready? Uh, so here it is. It's thirty-five dollars a spin. Okay. You bet ten dollars straight up on the twelve. Okay. Okay. Ten dollars right there on the twelve. You bet ten dollars on the seventeen. Okay. Five dollars split to five eight. Okay. Uh, five dollars split to nineteen. Uh, where the hell is it? Nineteen twenty-two. Nineteen twenty-two. Okay. okay. And then uh, I think that's it, right? Nope. There's no. One more. There's one more. Twenty-nine thirty-two. 2932 split. That's it. That's it. Bam, done. And someone somehow he figured out this is something on the wheel, right? Yep. Is what I'm getting. It's yep. like the way that it is relationships, there's a bit of context going on here. It's kind of like when you know you go to the bathroom and the urinals on the one side and the other, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, 100%. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Understood. Mm -hmm. uh, 28. Just give me 35 bucks, sir. Wow. Yeah, just, yeah, 100%. Because, <laughs> I, yeah, that's to be a lot of work. All right, well, here's the thing. Already, uh, before we get into the commentary, okay. let's just say that if they want to book you and play this out, they can yep. go to casinoquest.biz, make a reservation. Yep. Uh, don't forget, we have a crapsy.com. If you like craps, you want to play it online, uh, crapsy.com. Yep. We also have, what else do we have? ShopCasinoQuest.com. We have, these are our new polos. Yep. You have one of the older polos, but yep. this is our new polos. They're peak polos, just so you know, so you could sweat your ass off in them. Guess how big we go, dude? We go up to 5X this time around. 5X. 35. Check it out. We have 5X. Uh, all the way up. And then um, we're just going to sit back here and see how quickly I can lose all this money. You know what I'm saying? Like, holy smokes. I don't know. Here's what I don't get. Okay. okay? Cause I got, I, I, I've, I've sat at a lot of dead crap tables that happen to be next to like roulette games. And I got people come over and they, they talk to me about the quadrants and how the wheel is positioned and they, and then the board lights up and they got, who the hell figured this one out? Like, why are we betting these numbers over any other numbers that's going on? Like what makes these numbers special? Yeah, I know. I, if I had a roulette system, be six and nine and just pound the shit out of that. Oh, I, I understand. See, that, I, I get that, though. I understand that, because that yeah. has, you have an emotional attachment to that yeah. number. No, That's I, 69 I, action. I always you go took, for it. You took all my, yeah, all just my set things. it up again. What 10, is it 10. now? 10, 10. 10. I made 12 and 17, 5 and 8. Oh, my God, I 19, can't believe it. 19, 22, 29, 19, 22, yep, and this go. one? Wow. Yeah. No, uh, sir, I always go for the 69. You know what's amazing is how often 69 comes up in life, just normal can, life. I could be like, it could be like smelling salts, you know, like yeah. I could be on my deathbed with dementia and stuff, you know, like yeah. something could happen to me and and that's be like, your last words. Yeah, it'd be like uh, all my favorite memories and stuff. They're like Alex Kim. No, you know, you know what? What's your favorite number? 69. Yeah. <gasps> and then that's it. Done. <laughs> yep. Last words. Dude. Yep. Famous. I put them on your grave. You know, um, We've been at Five Guys a Double few times. Zero. Every time we're, we're, oh my God, are you kidding me? Every time we're at like, the, our number in line is 65 or our checkout number is 60, I mean, that's 69. Everything's 69 over there. I don't know what they got going weird. on at Five Guys. They see us coming, they're like, listen. Chuckle, chuckle, chuckle. Yeah, 100%, dude. That's chuckle, chuckle. Alex Kim friendly order going Absolutely. on. Absolutely. No, 100%, dude. We should like we should like reprice everything here with it that just ends in sixty nine. Oh my we, god, that was so. By good. the way, we do we did in memory of Alex Kim. We were trying to come up with one of the prices on, on one of the things that we have, and we're like, oh, it's how come everything's not hey, six ninety nine? Yeah, why yeah. isn't it six sixty nine? I mean, uh, it's inflation, sir. It's oh, inflation. 
We gotta do yeah. that for April Fools next year. Now it's sixteen ninety nine. Oh, look at don't take my bet. What are you doing? Thirty five bucks against. Thirty five bucks. Yeah. Oh my god. Eight, 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 five and eight. Ten, ten. Ten, ten. Five, five. Okay. Well, I'm actually remembering your sort of twenty nine and thirty two. Wow. Uh, okay, wow. So what do we what do we think about the system? Six so far? to midnight. What would you give this? I'll tell you what mine you is. You know what I'd give it? I'd give it a like and subscribe. That's what I'd give it. What do you <laughs> think? I would throw that in there. They're always asking me to remind everybody. If, if you're in this far, you probably should. Uh, or either that or just rage quit the channel, dude. Just rage quit the channel. I know that term, dude. I'm not, I'm not completely boomered up, dude. I'm, I know that term, rage quit. I used to rage quit myself, dude. Oh, really? I was a raider. I was a gay, I was an MMO raider, and I would be, bucks. I would just get, have, have I won yet? No. Have I won a single thing? No. How did you pick these numbers? How did these numbers come out of your I ass? I mean, what? 35 bucks, sir. At thirty-five dollars. I mean, at what point were you playing around with yourself and you came up with this stuff? You know what I'm saying? In the middle of that, because that's that's where you get those big epiphanies. You know what I'm saying? Hundred percent. Yeah, I, I don't know how Brian came up with this, but I, out of all the roulette systems, I was like, which one's the most David friendly? No, this is Dave, this is a bit David friendly because after a that, minute, that's I'm the actually thumbnail for this one. David friendly. It Boop. is. A, it is a little work though to remember everything. This is not DTF. This is not DTF. No, because I, I mean, one drink in, I'm, I'm, I'm changing it up, so I'm gonna have some other number going on. It's only eight numbers, sir. I mean, it's a lot of numbers, dude. It's, it's just a like a girl's phone number, on. almost. You know? No, oh! Whoa, whoa! Straight up, sir. Oh my God, we have a genius, Brian, the genius. Oh my God. Okay, Welcome now. to the party, sir. Now it all makes sense. It's all coming clear. Now it's three fifty. I'm gonna push you. Holy smokes! When do I lose? I mean, when do I win? When do I leave? I should say. Once you have won five hundred dollars, oh crap, dude! I gotta <laughs> sit here and keep playing. Is that what you're saying? And you oh gotta still God. put another ten bucks over. Oh, I gotta put. So it, whatever it hits, for... you still bet the same. Uh, oh, I see. You just leave it. Yep, you leave, leave it, it. Leave it. And then five leave there. It. There you go, sir. And now I got another ten dollars. But hey, see now it make it's starting to make sense. Maybe there's yeah. something to the quadrant thing. Maybe okay. see people get weird epiphanies, you know. Okay. I get that when I'm uh, right after my, my morning coffee and muffin. Okay. Uh, sends me just, you know, running to the bathroom. That's my epiphany time. <laughs> that is 100% my epiphany time. It's like a little porcelain, a recollection, uh, everything just, yeah, just. Oh, really? While it's all coming out, it's coming clearer every okay. minute by now minute. Set it up 35. Uh, okay, now I'm going back to the 35. I mean, this type of system, I feel like you should bring like your Kindle. Watch it. You're or your kids. Book. Or your kids. So they bring can, your kids. They can tell you, you they, when to stop. Yeah. They're like, Daddy, Daddy, enough oh, is God. enough. We got to get over to the uh, rides. Daddy, play the rides. responsible gambling. Yeah, hundred percent. Responsible gaming. Yeah. Why are you? Yeah. Why are you messing with my trust fund? Daddy, when the fun stops. Yeah, hundred percent. Do, do kids even have trust fund? Can anybody afford a trust fund? Isn't that now the gas fund? Yeah. Trust fund is now the gas fund. You know what I'm saying? I swear yeah. to God. They're like, sorry, kid. College is gonna have to wait. Papa's got to fill up the Bronco. You know what I'm oh, saying? Oh, gosh. <laughs> no, the Ford Expedition. The Ford Expedition. Eight have miles you seen, per gallon. Dude, have you seen these land yachts they got? These land yachts. Can you imagine? And, and like right before all this, because gas was cheap bucks, for sir. a minute, dude. Gas was cheap. 35 bucks. Now sir. those land yachts are they're definitely, you know, that's a setback, buddy. That is a setback. You know what I mean? I heard there's a fire sale of uh, mega yachts right now, so. Oh, yeah, no, 100%. They're pushing those around. They don't know who, nobody wants them. They cost a fortune. They got, I, know, I mean, it's weird. They've been pulling up to docks and trying to get, get fuel. Maybe, it, maybe it's on Nellis Auction. Imagine that. They have maybe like a got, super, a, a Craigslist. They're one of them sold on Craigslist, supposedly. A, a flipping cruise ship, dude. Yeah. Because who, who, first of all, if you have a cruise ship and you don't want it anymore, you want to like, who the hell is going to buy that right now? Maybe they, Gas that bitch up, it's going to set you back a little they're bit. They're like, let me go on Casual Encounters. Oh, look, there's a, a yacht. A yacht, yeah. Eight. Okay. Oh 85. my God. Wow. Are you kidding me? This guy is a flipping genius. He knows the quadrants, dude. I, you know what it is? You might not be able to get away with it. He might have figured out the secret sauce. Yeah? This could be the secret sauce, dude. Another you don't five, even know. Sir. Oh, another whole number of five? Yep. Uh, because uh, basically, you know, I, I can see where these are like the, those magic numbers that somehow. This is like Nicolas Cage and National Treasure. No, 100%. He is a national treasure, huh? Yeah, he is. One no, true god. We've seen him. He is him. the one true you god. You met him, and I saw him on that Zoom, whatever that Zoom thing was, peering in. Yeah. I saw him in that hat. He was trying to be anonymous. Is like, hey. I know. If you guys don't know, let him know, you can look at our uh, gambler story thing. We did the two-hour thing. It was actually worth the two hours. It was pretty funny. No, 100%, dude. Yeah, no. He is a national You treasure. can hear my laugh. <laughs> He's the full gamut of the American experience. How to evade taxes. You know what I'm saying? How not to pay your... You know what I mean? 
how to just, you know, B movies, A movies. He's he's been every tier possible, dude. He's this been all true. over. That's true. And he's a, he has a girlfriend to prove it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, 100%. Yeah. Yeah, no. We've met one of them. <laughs> Woo! Wow. We don't want to we don't want to add to that though, right? We don't want to take that one out. All right. Ready? 5 to 8. It's 12. already out there anyways. Yeah, no. It's all out in the public. You can look it up. Yep. That was the two the two day marriage that should be uh, forgotten. All right, so here we go. Bam. Okay, there we go. By the way, I would love to party with Nicholas, hundred percent. Really? Oh, hundred percent. I bet he's uh, I bet he's a lot of fun, dude. Seriously, a lot of fun. Plus, the girls that come to his table, I mean, you know, what I'm saying like, I want to be in that chair, dude. I just want to be in the chair. Thirty-five oh, bucks, God, sir. Another thirty-five dollars, man. I, I used to, when I was younger, and you know, he's still acting. He's still out there. He's still out of movies, dude. He's busy. Fantastic. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no. We just need one of his. You know, holy crap. All right, well, what are you thinking about this system so far? Where uh, are we at? Terrible. Really? Terrible. I mean, look at me. I got a, I got stacks over here. I got stacks. My stacks have stacks. It, wait, what did I buy you for? 525. You're, okay, you're so almost even, sir. I'm about even. I'm sitting here even, we're having a nice conversation. You know what I'm saying? That's not a lot of bets to remember. Mm -mm. I feel like it's all, if I hit one more of these, if it's, uh, 20, oh. Oh my God, you see what I'm saying? Secret sauce, buddy. I, I think this guy's got to, I think he's figured out roulette, dude. This is the yeah, biggest. I think this is the solve for roulette. This is these the biggest, are the quadrants. Yeah, this is the biggest confused boner so far. Go ahead, <laughs> really? sir. Yeah. I mean, it seems to be working though, buddy. All right, here, but this one now, I go up to 10, okay, right? Yep. I got set. Look at this. I, I mean, I'm even at the point where I'm remembering where the hell to put my money. So proud of you, sir. I mean, am I winning? I think I'm winning. You are winning. You're up uh, 50, 50 bucks, 50, 60 sir. bucks. Yeah, 100%, dude. I'm that, ready. Hey, you know how Not many uh, two for here. 20s at uh, Applebee's you can get? Uh, that's a lot of keto. Applebee's can kind of suck it at this point. Serving really? out of a bag, dude, that's embarrassing, man. I mean, that's embarrassing. They're serving bags. I can make a bag. I'm actually got the, I can drop it in boiling water and boil it up. What about Olive Garden and Buco de Beppo? 35, sir. They, oh my God, are you kidding me? How dare you? Are you kidding me? Cheesecake Factory, 35, sir. It's all out of bags now? Everybody's serving out of bags? I mean, kind of. 35, really? sir. Really? They don't have actual chefs back there cooking anymore? They just put it in a bag and drop it in boiling water? Are you kidding me? I mean, Applebee's, I can kind of believe. That lady literally said it came out of the same bag. Okay, I, so I believe that. But I, Olive Garden is, you know, second tier, dude. It's another tier, no? Uh, yeah, second tier, like D tier oh, from F. From F tier? Yeah. It's like moving up. I tried to take Dennis to Applebee's the other day. He refused, dude. He wanted to go fast food over Applebee's. I was stunned. Me and you have, have, have uh, really, we, ba me and you, our, our first real business deal was at an Applebee's, dude. I know. We, we I had, literally, uh, that was like when I first started getting yeah. to know you. I was like, yeah. hey, out of all the places, where do you want to go eat? Where yeah, can 100%. we chat? Applebee's. I'm your average white guy, 35. dude. Applebee's is it. You know, they have a two for 20. I was like, two for 20. That's like genius, buddy. That is genius. Bucks. Are you kidding me? At Chili's, it was two for 25, so that you'd have to really kind of, eh, you know what I mean? Is it I, worth? Yeah. What about Chili's? Is Chili's the same level as Applebee's? Yes. Or is it Chili's an upgrade? It's the same shit. Wow, really? I, I have friends who feel like Chili's is an upgrade, dude, because they, they have those really nice chicken things, whatever, with the sauce. I don't know what the hell it's called, but it's some kind of like spicy. Um, Are your spicy. friends like 65 plus? <laughs> well, are you are you refer? You think that I can qualify for the sixty-five plus menu? I didn't say is that. that what you're saying? No, is that what I didn't you're say saying? that. I'm just saying that the all food is just like no. They have this uh, super salty. They have what they call over. spicy chicken thing as an appetizer, which okay. I love. I love the. I forget what the name of the sauce is, dude. You know, but uh, are you are you kidding me? Olive Garden. Wait, wait. Buca de Beppo. Yeah. Is out of a bag. Thirty-five, sir. Wow. I mean, I would not, I would not believe that, dude. I, I just, I can't, I mean, that would really hurt my heartstrings, dude. That would really hurt. That would really hurt. Yeah. I love, we love their chicken parm, dude. They got some great chicken parm, dude. And if you're saying that it's out of bag, it, it's, you know what's interesting? It's always, everything there always tastes exactly the same. I know, it's so and weird. And now that I'm thinking about it, I'm thinking, oh, crap, dude. They look so busy back there. What the hell are they doing? <laughs> They're well, moving they bags thing, around. They have this thing called. They're not. They're not they have doing a thing it. called a microwave, and they have a thing called an air fryer. No, I know the air fryer, genius. I know. I saw that at an expensive restaurant one time. I was stunned, and the guy came out to like calm me down, because I was like, no flipping way. Thirty-five dude. bucks. Sir. I just spent a hundred dollars, and you're telling me you got air fryers stacked up, and they're like, yeah, but we make the sauces because it was for the sauce mm -hmm. and the soups. 
And they literally, I, I saw them as I was walking by, I saw them all stacked up, ready to do air fryers. Know, it's, just, it's just so weird. Once I stopped eating out, I lost a shit ton of weight. Really? Yeah. I mean, have they figured out, do they have a machine that makes like cheesecake too? <laughs> What's going on here? Sir, they it's, don't called, just it's like, called a freezer. I know, but don't they just, <laughs> I mean, do they mix this shit up anymore or they just dial it in? Dial it in. Just oh my God, we're getting, we're getting the wrap it up signal. We're getting the wrap it up signal. Sir, sir. All I the mean, chain existential. Uh, if you wonder how the bread is the same at those restaurants, oh, another God. 35, we'll do one more. All right, well, let's do one more. I'm, I'm a little bit, I'm all a little bit. All the bread at the sandwich places like Subway and stuff, it all comes pre-frozen, sir. Or no, no, yeah. that one's baked, that one's baked, but the other sandwich places come frozen. You know why I know that? Because no. my parents and I used to own a Quiznos. Yeah, no, a lot of shortcuts nowadays. They're just fooling yeah. everybody, man. I'm just so stunned, dude. I got to go in and ask, like, how many bags do you serve here? I mean, I'm just, oof, God. Anyways, all right. Well, what are we doing here? Are we winning? I'm so depressed now. You depressed the hell out of me. I'm never going to eat out again. I'm going to go visit the kitchen, see if they have an actual just, cook. Just, just go back and eat it at the pound pad. Oh, Dennis's pound pad? Yeah. yeah. No. Oh. Wow. Oh, see that? Wow. One for the road, buddy. You see? I'm at four. And how much do I got now? Holy crap. We're going to count this up at the very end. I, I got to say. We're all finished, sir. Bring I'm it in. Not... How much we got? All right. Well, let's not. Let's include. All right. Well, we have here. Uh, oh, here. Here. Okay. Crap dealer. Move it in. All right. Well, I got four. 400. That's four. Uh oh. I think I shorted myself. Oh, yeah. These are all short ones. They're all short? Oh, my God. Okay, so we got four, four, I'm a bit of 70. a loser, dude. I'm a bit of a loser. You lost uh, 55 bucks. I mean, it's not the worst thing, no. huh? I, I got a feeling like these are the secret numbers, dude. That he's like one number away from like unlocking the roulette secrets. You know okay. what I'm saying? I don't know how he got there because the, the numbers on their own, they don't seem like they make sense, but now they do. Crazy okay. like a fox. Dude. So what would you give this rating? Uh, I'm gonna give it. A, I'm gonna give it a plum. Yeah. I really, if I, if I had worked out, if it had worked out worse, then I would have moved it down. But I think a plum, it's not bad. Now, uh, for me, sir, mm -hmm. if you give a shit about your money, this is like a peach plum. A peach plum, if you give if, a shit. If you're an absolute piece of shit like me. Actually, yeah, eggplant. total degen. Really? Eggplant. This, you're not putting enough money at risk. Th you this can't is really not, make this enough. This is not a dopamine hit for me. No, this system not doesn't a lot give of opportunity. Me, no. It's nice and slow. I don't get enough dopamine hits off of this. What, what if you like triple, mar you know, triple press on a hit? Maybe. There you go. But just the flat? That could give you the tingles, buddy. Yeah. Two out of ten, not enough tingles. dopamine. So I'll give it an eggplant if you're a DGen. All right, well, there you go. All right, you heard it here first, guys. Thank you so much for joining. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Alex and David, out. Bye. See you guys. Hello, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Please take a minute to like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And if you'd like to come visit us, you can book a reservation at CasinoQuest.biz. And you can also check out this table on our new store. It's an eight-foot craps table kit that you can get to your own house and set up in under 10 minutes. Thank you so much, and I look forward to seeing you next time. We're here at Casino Quest. Take care. Bye.